The war is over, Rick. Oh, we don't know that. I'm talking about you. I'm saying, and I'm saying this. You pull Carl back from going out there. Fine. He shot that boy. Yeah. He needs his father. He needs his father to show him the way. What way are you going to show him? He can shoot. We know that. What's his life going to be? What's yours? Please save him. Nothing wrong with staying close, Rick. Everyone understands. You're growing us enough food, so we won't need to do a run soon. But we do have to find you a good pair of overalls. You need to look the part. A little piece of wheat out of the corner of your mouth. Maybe a bigger ass. Yeah. Listen, the rest of the council, Daryl, Glenn, Carol, Sasha, all of them. They wanted me to talk to you. When you go out there, you gotta take your gun. Easy now. It's just outside the fence. I have my knife. If you get in trouble, six bullets aren't gonna make a difference. This was you, not me! You did this to us! This was you, not me! Not me! Not me! Rick, we want you to be safe. Bring your gun. You should keep your gates closed. Why? Because it's all about survival now. At any cost. People out there are always looking for an angle. Looking to play on your weakness. Still don't get it. They measure you. By what they can take from you. By how they can use you to live. You! You just... Shit! and hesitate. Pretend like you know when you don't. I'm not sorry for what I said last night. You're not one of us! I'm sorry for not saying it sooner. You ever hear the one about the stupid little prick named Rick who thought he knew shit but didn't know shit and got everyone that he gave a shit about killed? About you. I swear on my second sight. I have a plan. I captured two of them. They're the key. I'm gonna help us take that prison without firing a shot. Move the word! I ain't gonna beg you. I ain't begging you. No. Was the joke that bad? <laughs>